Hey guys, it's Jason with Kentucky Sustainable Living. Today I've got uh, Bobby Spags with Spags Unfiltered. He was kind enough to give us one of his bug out bags. I think there's one. Let me read. This is a piece of paper with his autograph on it. It's big time with his autograph. It says, congratulations friend, you're the proud owner of a limited edition Spags Bag MK3. There are only 38 of these bags in existence. Uh, and also remember, there's extra space built in this bag for you to customize it with your clothing choices and extra items such as medications and anything else you require to get home wherever you find yourself in trouble. Uh, these bags are only sold at the three shows at Midwest Preparedness, uh, Self-Reliance Festival, and the Kentucky Sustainable Living Festival. I've got the contents of the bag out right now and it's like Bobby said, I, I went through, looked at the bag, everything that's in it, this is all the contents. Uh, there is room still left in this bag for you to put clothes in, any of your medications, any other items that you can customize this with. First, the bag. It's a pretty nice bag. I like it. It's black. Uh, it's no tactical colors, anything like that. There's lots of people that have black backpacks, so you're not gonna stand out in like a multi-cam or something like that. It does have a hydration bladder with it, and the hydration bladder is inside right here. Looks like a nice one. Uh, I like the bag, it's super nice. Uh, it's just the right size to throw in your trunk, something like that. All right, we'll start over here and work our way over. One of the things is 36 inch uh, universal splint. You can take these, mold them. Uh, if you've got a broken arm, anything like that, that you need to immobilize something, you can use it. I've got lots of splints. I keep a splint in my get home bag also, and I've got tons of them in there. You get an awesome Spags unfiltered sticker too. Uh, then we've got a set of Four, four sets of hand warmers. These are six hour hand warmers. If your fingers get cold, uh, I get dead in the water when my hands are cold and can't do anything. Hand warmers are something great to have in a bag. Uh, you've got four sets there. Two chem lights, awesome to have around. These are 12 hour, 12 hour chem lights. You've got uh, stormproof sweet fire. These are a strikeable fire starter. So you can actually strike these and start a fire with, I would assume they're windproof and waterproof. So that's awesome. So I mean, even if they get wet, they're still gonna strike and be good to get a fire started. We've got a Mora knife. And if you know anything about the Mora knives, they're awesome, uh, inexpensive knives. They're still a good high quality knife, but they will not break the bank. And this one is pretty stinking razor sharp. Yeah, it's taking hairs off. The more knives, I've got uh, several of these. I keep one in the truck and one in some other bags, but you got that. You have essentially, it's an emergency survival water straw. Looks like the life straws and stuff like that. Water is a super big thing to have. Uh, if it was me, I would put some water in my bag or in my vehicle that I've got just so you've got water right then if you need it and you don't have to stop to filter it. But you've got a straw. These are, yeah, there's a one pack, uh, instant cold packs. You snap these and they turn instant cold. Those are great for all kinds of things. We've got an emergency survival blanket. This is, uh, says reflects body heat, wind and water and wind resistant, compact and lightweight. And honestly, it's a super lightweight emergency blanket. It's silver on ones. It's, yeah, olive. Yeah, olive and silver or orange and silver. And this is a 48 by 84 inch survival blanket. Here is a uh, small boo-boo kit. Uh, I'm not gonna open it because I want the winner to uh, be able to open it. Uh, but it's got alcohol prep pads, from what I can see, band-aids, uh, ibuprofen, Tylenol, and some stuff like that, just for minor boo-boos and stuff. One thing that you could add on to this is a uh, IFAC, an individual first aid kit. 
Uh, you could strap it on there somewhere. It's got shock cord on here. You could shock cord it on there, and that would be a great upgrade with it. Uh, road Atlas, a small handheld road atlas. This covers United States, Canada, and Mexico. And it's got every state in there. And then it goes down, and it's got Canada and Mexico also. We've got uh, a compass with a lanyard on it where you can put it around your neck. It looks like a nice compass. Uh, I want to save this till the last. That's one of the cool things I saw. We've got three packs of trail mix. What we've got in this trail mix ingredients, uh, coconut, cashews, pecans, pumpkin seeds, sunflower seeds, cranberries, raisins, uh, currants, cinnamon, orange, honey, and seasonings. So you got three packs. These are from uh, Honey's Kitchen. So you got three packs of trail mix. And then also from Grumpy Acres, freeze-dried Skittles. I mean, if I'm in the end of the world and apocalypse and trying to get home, I want some freaking freeze-dried Skittles. They will take you back home and make you happy and give you an energy burst. One of the coolest things, and I did open this up because I didn't know exactly what it was from the outside, but it's a lockpick set. And I thought, a lockpick set? I don't know, let's see how many pieces this is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. A seven piece lockpick set. Uh, seven, eight piece lock set. Lockpick set. Honestly, Bobby really thought about this, putting in a lockpick set. Uh, I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna call him and find out where he got this lockpick set at, and I'm going to buy one. But guys, uh, this is, uh, Bobby called it the MK3 uh, bag, and it's the Spags bag. You can get this, you can purchase these at our festival at KentuckySustainableLiving.com. But this particular bag is going to be in our raffle, and uh, we're going to sell raffle tickets for it. So you could win this bag if you're at our festival and uh, buy the tickets for it. But uh, pick those up. Grumpy Acres is selling them at their booth, and uh, Grumpy Acres will be at our festival. But guys, uh, go to the website, sign up for the email list, let us know that you are coming so we can uh, plan and everything for that. But it's KentuckySustainableLiving.com, and uh, Spags Unfiltered, this is his bag. Thanks, guys.